Okay, this will be an interesting piece. I uh, found it on the ground, I think it was yesterday. If I remember correctly, it's a very nice looking thing we have here we're going to work with. I don't know how big we're going to enlarge it, so we're going to enlarge it 380, 380. So we're going to make it 380 both ways. Uh, color adjust, we're going to bump the contrast up. And the copy density will stay the same. Okay, let's see what it is. Uh, it's an interesting thing. It is. Found it. It's a double six domino. I think that's the highest score in dominoes. Fuck, I've forgotten how to play that game. But I once had a long winning streak on a game of dom on dominoes. I was in hospital when I was a kid, and I had a game. I had dominoes. Normally, in when I played games like board games or any kind of games, I used to keep losing, or I never used to win. At least I never used to win. But I had this huge winning streak, which eventually did get broken, but I had a huge winning streak playing the game of dominoes. And I was about eight years old, and it was really cool winning something all the time. Just kept winning, winning, winning. It's like I just wouldn't, it just seemed like the streak wasn't going to end. Eventually it did, but basically. Well, I think you got to match the, the dots or something. I've forgotten how to play that fucking game. It's, but it was nice to to win all the time, or most for the for a while it seemed I won all the time. <laughs> but it was really nice for a change to win instead of lose. <laughs> so now we're just going to make this into something interesting. Uh, I think it's going to be a dual color job. We're going to use this as a master copy. But yeah, I just have a good memory of the game, as in not memory of how to play the game, but how, how I kept on winning. It just seemed like I was just on a winning streak. I don't know why, why that happened. I don't know what controls whether a person wins or loses. Um, it's, but somehow I just kept winning. I don't know why, because <laughs> normally I tend to lose. That's probably why I don't like fucking games. <laughs> Maybe that's it. <laughs> I wonder if we're going to um, do the background removal thing. Oh, we're going to leave it. We're just going to try and set this up to look good. So I think we've got everything set up nicely. But yellow is also a happy colour. It's a, ha it's a colour that I associate with happiness. So maybe it was, maybe there's something in it. I don't know. But yeah, dominoes, memories. Oh, but there's one thing I hate, Domino's, is pizza. Domino's pizza is disgusting. So, yeah, you, you, you can't win on, win on that one. You can't win with Domino's pizza. It's disgusting. But, you know, a lot of people like it. It's meant to be cheap. I mean, really cheap. <laughs> and basically it makes use of lowly paid delivery drivers and delivery riders. So it's not, a very, it's not very ethical. Uh, for the people working there so basically yeah I just don't like the Domino's Pizza I prefer Pizza Hut or I like Pizza Hut actually as far as as far as pizza chain stores go I like I like Pizza Hut Pizza Hut's very tasty uh, the best pizzas of course are the gourmet pizzas now that it's a bit of a light colour it's not that dark. I was hoping it was going to be darker red. So I'm wondering if we're going to just make it darker. But basically I enjoyed I enjoyed Pizza Hut. Pizza Hut tastes really good. Really nice. The Domino's. I don't know what it is about Domino's pizza. Why it tastes so bad. Uh, maybe they use that terrible plastic cheese instead of real cheese and I really hate plastic cheese really it's really sickly it's got a bland sickly taste which I really 
abhor, so I wouldn't be surprised. I, I tried Domino's back in the 1990s when they were just starting out, and basically I've never had anything nice to say about their pizzas, so I've just basically always hated the taste of their pizzas. We're going back to yellow. This will be a different kind of yellow. But basically I just don't like the pizza. But the game, it was, I wouldn't want to play dominoes again. I'm not into games. I don't like games at all. I uh, just don't like them. I don't know why, I just don't. I'm just not a person that enjoys board games or any kind of games. I mean, maybe photocopier art could be classified as a game when you're trying to get a real winning look on your on your work, but that's about it. But it was nice to have a winning streak when I was a little girl, staying in hospital. So let's see how we go. Didn't hear the beep. That's odd. Sometimes that happens with me in photocopiers. Sometimes strange things do happen like that. Happened once on an opal card reader as well. I put my card up against the reader, as you normally would, and basically I I saw the I saw the um, I saw that it, 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 it acknowledged my card, but it didn't make any beeping noise. It just did it silently. It just acknowledged my card silently for some reason. I don't know why. Uh, strange. Okay, let's see how that looks, the green. Okay, let's just put our pieces together. So now we're just going to slide that. Whoops, just got the corner on there. So we're just going to try and line it up. Let's try and line it. Oh fuck, I nudged this one out of place. I don't know why. I obviously didn't place it nicely, nicely. It's difficult trying to line these up once you've nudged them. It's really annoying. So now we're just going to try and put this one into place and hopefully I've got the red one in the right place. It's not try to line it up like so still a little bit crooked I can see there's a gap there which really pisses me off because the red isn't in the right place anyway I think that's good enough I think that looks quite nice I think now we can call this double six domino demo quits